न्यूट्रिशन इन ह्यूमन बींग न्यूट्रिशन इन ह्यूमन बींग टेक्स प्लेस विद द हेल्प ऑफ डाइजेस्टिव सिस्टम विच इंक्लूड एलिमेंटरी कैनल एंड डाइजेस्टिव ग्लैंड एलिमेंटरी कैनल इज लॉन्ग ट्यूब लाइक स्ट्रक्चर एक्सटेंडिंग फ्रॉम माउथ टू एनर्स डाइजेस्टिव ग्लैंड इंक्लूड सेलेवरी ग्लैंड लीवर दैनक्रियाज एंड गैस्ट्रिक ग्लैंड माउथ इन माउथ लार्ज फूड आर ब्रोकन डाउन इंटू स्मॉल पार्टिकल विद द हेल्प ऑफ टीथ सलाइवा सिक्रेटेड बाय सेलेवरी ग्लैंड वेट द फूड so that it can pass through alimentary canal saliva contain enzyme called salivary amylase that breaks down starch into simple sugar maltose thus digestion starts in mouth itself stomach the rhythmic contraction and relaxation of muscles of the canal are called peristalsis it helps the food to move forward through esophagus food reach to j shaped organ called stomach stomach is located at left side of abdomen in the stomach gastric glands present in the walls of the stomach secrete three juices namely hydrochloric acid enzyme pepsin and mucus in presence of acidic medium provided by hydrochloric acid pepsin digest proteins mucus protect the inner lining of stomach from acid wall of stomach churn the food and help in mixing the gastric juice in food sphincter muscle present at the end of stomach regulates the movement of food into small intestine small intestine small intestine is a long coil like structure placed compactly in the belly its average length is about 5 to 6 meter carbohydrates fats and proteins are fully digested in small intestine the largest gland liver secrete bile juice which is stored in gall bladder gall bladder secrete bile juice into small intestine which creates alkaline medium in the small intestine and also breaks large fat molecules into smaller ones so that enzymes will act easily on small molecules pancreas secrete pancreatic juice consisting enzymes trypsin lipase and pancreatic amylase trypsin digest proteins lipase break down fats and pancreatic amylase digest carbohydrates bile and pancreatic juice enters small intestine through common duct wall of intestine also secretes intestinal juice which converts proteins into amino acid complex carbohydrates to glucose and fats into fatty acids walls of small intestine have large number of finger like projections called villi villi absorbs the food it is then carried to other parts of the body by blood unused glucose is stored as glycogen in the liver the unabsorbed food is then sent to large intestine large intestine large intestine is about 1.5 meter long the completely digested food enters in large intestine walls of large intestine have villi which absorbs the water and salt from the digested food the waste material is then removed from the body through anus